Overall, today I can tell you the truth that uh, I felt the fatigue after so many weeks of racing. Today was the day that I felt it got up to me. Uh, but overall, it was good because we reached our goal to be second at least. Uh, so now we still have a chance to make it to Las Vegas, uh, which we have to win in, in London. Uh, but it's still doable, you know, we still have the chance. And uh, yeah, it was overall, it was good, you know, we reached all our goals. How I feel? Well, I feel very tired. <laughs> but uh, as far as the show goes, uh, I say this every time that it exceeded my expectations of what the show would be. Uh, just besides all the lights and the show, it's the results that are very impressive. Uh, we see the results that would win world championships and get world championship medals in you know, most of the races. Uh, so that's, that's very, very impressive that we can show the kind of results back to back in a lot of races. Well, it feels great, you know. Uh, I actually think that we are the underdog, you know, in the European, in the European cluster of teams. But it feels great because we win a lot of um, tough races, like the 200 butterfly, 400 individual medley. Uh, we don't score as many points in the relays, which is double points, but we win the, the skin races, which is triple points. So it feels great. We have a great mix of uh, here and there. Um, yeah. It got to me today, I realized, after the 100 freestyle, that I tried my best and I was a second, almost a second slower from my best time, a second and a half. Um, but I think from just flying, you know, this is the third time that I'm flying from Europe to the United States and back, it's a 12 hour flight. Uh, and also racing, I did three events yesterday, uh, 45 two splits in the relay, the last race. Um, so overall, I, don't, I mean, it happens, you know, it has to happen one of these days after so much racing and so much traveling. And I guess I, I only have to be glad that I reached that point. Definitely because of the team, uh, I wish that Sabo also pulled through into the second round, but he had like four or five events today. Uh, but I heard the team and the whole stadium cheering Moros open. I heard them cheering Russia, Russia. <laughs> and it definitely pumped me up. But uh, you know, during the race, of course, I had to control my breathing and get focused on the race. But it was something special. And when I was walking there and uh, breathing, controlling, uh, the coach told me, you know, it's once in a lifetime. Just enjoy this moment, and I really tried to enjoy it. Uh, like I said, we have to win in London, which is a pretty tough goal, but I think that it is possible because we have some additions coming to London. We have Kira Tucson, Tucson in the backstroke. We have some freestyle girls that, that's going to help us in the relay. But overall, we have to race it even faster, you know, even tougher to win in London. Of course, we have energy standard coming in there. Um, but it's doable, you know, we still have hope. Hope that's last.